I have one question, and I'm a huge fan of your film, so this just uh, comes quite naturally. Can you please sell me this pen? <laughs> <laughs> so let me let me tell you what that whole exercise really stands for, right? So the whole sell me this pen narrative is really it's a test that you give to a salesman to see if they really understand what selling is all about. If you ask someone who's not a professional salesman who doesn't have the right instincts they'll start actually trying to sell you a pen. This pen is great. This pen writes upside down. It's the best value for its money. This pen will last forever. Buy this pen. Here's the thing. The only one rational thing you could do when someone says, sell me this pen, and that is to start asking them questions. So tell me, how long have you been in the market for a pen? What type of pens have you used in the past? Is it a business or personal? Typically when you buy a pen, what type of money do you spend on one? Do you buy expensive pen? I, you, the, the key to selling is to find out, step one, what are your client's needs, values, what pain are they looking to resolve, what, what do they need? And you're looking to fill that need at the most basic level, right? Well, when you just go out and try to sell something, something, what you're saying is, I don't give a shit about you, I'm just gonna ram this down your throat, right? I wanna know what you need, I wanna know what you've done in the past, so you ask questions. If I ask someone, hey, so how long have you been in the market for a pen? They say, oh, I'm not looking for a pen. Great, have a nice day. I don't sell people the things that people aren't looking for. I wouldn't try to sell you a pen if you're not looking to buy a pen. So that's, and if someone said to me, I'd say, wow, this person really knows how to sell. Because the biggest mistake that rookie sales would make is they try to sell to everybody versus weeding out people who are not interested and only selling to those who are. So I ask questions, but not any question. I ask pointed questions to identify what type of you use in the past, how much money you have. Now the pen is like a euphemism for any product, right? By doing that, I can get a good sense of what you're about. And then when I'm done asking my questions and I know what I need to know, I'll say, well, based on what you said to me, this pen is a perfect, you let me tell you why. And now I'm actually matching my pen to what you need. And I tailor that presentation to fill that name. And it's much more elegant. Make sense? Yes. Okay, Thank great. You.